Hello again folks, welcome back to the next episode of Joxa playing Skyrim, the Argonian Assassin. In the previous episode, we finally got to off tent and made our way down. Um, we found a Khajiit who apparently had lost his mind and uh, I can only imagine him ending up having killed his brother. He seemed to be sick and he mentioned a disappearance in his journal. And kinda that's where we're at right now. Uh, kinda anxious to see what's... Ahead of us, and what I can expect. I'll take that. I'm specifically not taking all the Dwemer metal because then I'll end up running back and forth for like ages. Umana! It's been out a week since. Just reading this quickly. Uh, what's your Anemonculary? Anemonculary. Culori. Okay. Why the dwarves would produce their automatons. <coughs> Ooh, that sounds a little uh, ominous. There's definitely oil. Uh Maybe they didn't see me. Ah, I'm not complaining. <laughs> Serana. Knew I heard something. That's the second time I hit Serana. Why did you go stand in the way? Oh my god, Serana! Can't see. Ah, there you go. Oh, it's okay. We we got still. We're sneaking. It was an accident, Serana. I swear. This is uh. Okay, so normally I'd have no problems in a dungeon like this, but the constant, like the sound of the pistons going at it, is a little creepy. I'm not gonna lie. Do you have to go up those pistons? Looks like it. Interesting. Come on. Oh. Come on. I. Aha! Wow! That's not too shabby at all. Cloak, Dwemer Ceremonial. I'll take that. Um, I do think that using Vampire Sight here would be worth it. See? It's always worth it. That's about it. Crafty little Dwemer. Oh... I see that. And I am not stupid. Oh. Went in a little deeper as I had expected. Whoops. But that's perfectly fine. Uh, aura Whisper, because I really don't like surprises. Hey god, there's one in that pipe over there. There's actually quite a few here. Blacksmithing Forge, interesting. There we go. Easy enough. Let's 
going okay thus far. Okay, can go to the left and to the right. Looks like this is just a uh, storage area. All of the loots. I've got 100 pick lock and lock picking. It's no problem whatsoever. RK. There we go. Uh, auto pick. Daedric Katana. Wow, look at that. Looks kind of cool. I'm not gonna take the uh, the gauntlets because uh, it weighs too much and it's worth absolutely nothing for me. Creepy. Another quick save, just in case. Hello. Oop. I see that pressure plate. There's rooms here to the sides as well. Well, let's have a quick looky. Ultimate healing, extreme stamina. There's a bed here if we wanted to sleep. But I don't see the necessity for sleeping right now. So we're gonna be pressing onwards. There's a door. Like seriously, I can handle dungeons, but hearing all of these noises constantly are just throwing my senses off like enormously. Boop. Yeah, oh, hello. Blacksmith potion. Probably has to do with the fact that this was um, the robotic creation area. Okay, this looks like this is going onwards with the dungeon. So my question now is, what's behind the door? Not a lot of things to get here. And suddenly it turned really quiet. <laughs> Dwemer plate, not too interested. Alvin helmet of restoration and lockpicks. Again, I'm not going to be looting any of the Dwemer uh, metal stuff to melt it down because, you know, that it weighs so much and I don't want to end up tracking back and forth through the dungeon forever. Learned my lesson, folks. Oh, this looks like it's going to be fun. Turn on our vampire side. Who's there? Oh no, it's a tarp. Oh. Let's 
trying to get out of the way. It's a tarp, it's a tarp. Really? Okay, we got it. Whew. It's not so much the... Uh, the spiders being scary, it's more the fact that, you know, we were in between those pistons. There. But uh, we were getting further away. Deeper. What is this? Okay. Let me uh, quickly do a quick save here. In we go. Doing okay. We're doing okay. It, it's uh, I'm a little bit jumpy about the dungeon. I'm not gonna lie. I'm a little jumpy, and it's because of all of those constant noises all around me that makes me go like, because normally when I'm sneaking, I'm like trusting on the sounds that I'm hearing from bandits talking or something coming towards me. Ah, uh, looks like it's no different here. I'd almost say this looks like uh, somewhere where I've already been, but uh, I'm pretty sure it's not. Oh, I'm seeing something that I don't like. Shit in parts. That means farm roll, right? I thought whenever I draw my weapon that Serana would draw, my we draw her weapon, but apparently not. Okay. Well, first things first. Checking out a whisper to see if there's any thing hidden behind the door, and not directly, but there's stuff here though. Really shouldn't be using my dragon bow uh, arrows on that. These things should I? Oh, you can actually go in here. Oh god. Oh, that doesn't look too good for that guy. Diamond, gold, peerless magicka. And a magic great sword, why not? And Drust! Well, he was an elf. Let's have a looky. The eyeless creatures, uh, I guess that's Falmer. Well, they killed each other. Yeah, and I tried for the top of the cave shaft, but one of the rams was broken. Well, you didn't get very far. Damn. That is a little sad. Getting eaten by spiders. Question is, can I actually like cast my fire rune yet? Nope, I can't. That answered that question. I see you. Come on, and whoop. I know there's something in there. There's a lot of oil here. There is a lot of oil there. I'm gonna go and be smart and put those on fire. Who's there? Doing that because I don't want something to sneak up on me. Done and done. Well, I mean more like I don't want something to sneak up on me and then you know accidentally shooting into the f uh, oil and make it all light up. 
Oh, and here we start. Chorus. Yep, yep, yep. It's okay, we're gonna keep on going. We should to get these Chorus eggs because it's not bad having that. Bigaboo! I know that there's something here. Seeing pressure plates. Ooh, look at Serana. For those of you wondering, um, these things over there, pressure plates, and th this thing here kind of set me off. Like, it looks like something could go in between. So, yeah, let's let, let's just be safe. Something in there. Where'd you come from? That'll teach you. Uh -huh. Um. Okay. Oh, dear Lord. I forgot how big this place was. Well, folks, I'm going to go and call the episode here because my time just went. The next episode, we will be delving deeper into Alf Tent in search of the Elder Scroll. So, folks, as always, I'll be right back.